Hey everyone, and welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, I'll be teaching you guys how to add a restaurant menu as a widget or a plugin for your Elementor page, or I should say your WordPress website using the Elementor plugin from scratch. So without further ado, let's dive right in. So to actually do this is quite simple. And the idea is we'd want to get access to our website editor on WordPress. And to do so is quite simple. The first thing that we need to do is we want to make sure that we're logged into our WordPress account as an administrator. And like I said, we're trying to get access to the website editor. And there are a couple ways to get there being, uh, as you can probably see, under the Quick Links tab, there's an option that says Edit Site. So when you click on this, you'll be re redirected to this page right here, which we'll get to later when we go to add our menu. And another way is by clicking on Element Elementor or Appearance, Editor, or plugins, installed plugins, and selecting Elementor. So either way, uh, either way is really fine, but the, the idea is we just want to get to the site editor or the text editor for it. So once we're here, um, let's actually get back to this because we're going to add a widget here later. That's going to be a, uh, I would call it a canvas for HTML embed for our restaurant menu. So to show you guys what I mean, um, the website that we need to go to is elfsite.com. So Elf, Elf site, uh right off the bat, is a, a widget or plugin builder for your website. And here, um, what happens is their platform actually generates a survey for you or a form or any, honestly, any form of widget that you get to add uh, to your site builder via HTML code. So if we're going to be adding a restaurant menu here, you can click on the search bar under the apps catalog uh, menu and type down restaurant menu. So here it is. So we're simply going to click on it like so, and we'll be redirected to this page here where we get to choose uh, a format for our uh, for our menu. So let's do, um, okay, let's actually do a coffee shop or a cafe. So as you can see here, here's an example. Honestly, let's do the one with pictures because these ones look pretty good. So we can do either fast food or family restaurant, either way is really fine, doesn't matter. So, okay, let's go with uh, this one. So you want to select this, continue with template. And here you get to configure like the menu items as well as the price, um, the uh, the titles and the description and whatnot. So um, this one is entirely up to you guys, depending on how you want to customize it. And from here, you want to click on publish. So when you guys click on publish, you'll be met with this, asking you to either buy their paid plan or go for the free one. Now, obviously, we're going to go for the free one since we only need one. So from here, this is what we're looking for, the embed link right here. So we're going to copy this like so, and we're going to, we're going to go back to WordPress. So here we have the site editor. And if I were to add a new widget here, that was an HTML, we're going to type HTML just like this, and we're going to click, drag and drop it somewhere along the menu. So let's say I want to put it here um, for this widget right here. So here's the menu, here's the HTML. So what you need to do is click on this little box right here and paste the code that we just copied. And you'll see that we now have a restaurant menu for our website. And you can do stuff like drag it along or change, uh, change its position in our website. And that's honestly it. So yeah, hopefully this video helped you guys out. And if it did, be sure to let us know down in the comment section below. And if you guys want to see more videos like these, we do have a YouTube channel where we do guides like these daily. So if you guys want to show your support that, you can do so by subscribing to the channel. So with all of that said, thank you all for watching, and we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.